Hi all, in this video we are discussing about OpenHRMS Loan Management in Order 50. OpenHRMS is a open source HR management software which helps to manage all the HR operations and act as a definite solution for all the HR operations in your company. And moreover, it is suitable for both large scale and small scale enterprises. So in this video, we are discussing about HRMS Loan Management Module in Order 50. Loan Management is act as a component for OpenHRMS. It helps the user to configure different loan policies and to assign it for employees. It helps the user to configure different loan policies. So let's look on that feature. For that, first we need to install that module from the App Store. So in the app store, so the module or Charmus loan. So currently in my database, it is installed. Once we install this module or Charmus loan, we would be able to access this feature. For that, first let's look on the payroll. So in the payroll, under the configuration, we can see a menu salary rules. And here we can see the rules that are created for each salary structures. So while we install this module, automatically a rule is created that is loan and which is of detection type and also the computation is based upon a Python code which detects the input amount that we asked for our loan. So inside the salary structure, let's try to create a new structure based on this salary rule loan. And then we can add different rules. Also, let's include this loan inside it. So I created a new salary structure based upon the salary rule loan. And then let's create the loan request for the employee. For that, let's go to the employees module. So inside the employees module, we can see a new menu loans and advances. At here, we can create a request for loan. And it will move to a preview. It shows us currently it is filtered by my requests, which means who is the login user. The requests that are created by the login users can be shown at here. From here, we can create the loan requests. So while we open this form, currently I am logged in as Michelle Admin. So the employee, current login employee's name will be pop up at right here. So we can choose the employee. So I am just choose the employee Audrey Peterson. And for this employee who is belonging to a contract, for this contract, inside that contract, we need to add its salary structure is the loan structure. That is the structure which have the rule, salary rule loan. Then only that loan amount will be detected from its salary when, when they created the request. And then let's add the loan amount. So I am adding a loan amount as... 10,000 and then the payment start date and then the currency and then let's save it and then compute the installment At here we can add the loan amount and I added the loan amount as 10,000 and at here we can add the number of installments So I added for example as 5 and then the payment start date and then the currency and then the company name and the date is automatically populated based on today's date and then let's compute the installment so based upon the loan amount and then the number of installments, the installments will be added at here. That means on each month, how much amount will be detected from our salary. And then let's submit this. And it will be submitted to the admin. And then the admin can add the loan account and then the journal and also the treasury account. And they have the access to approve or refuse. And the admin can approve it. So for this Audrey Peterson, the loan request is approved it and the sequence for that particular loan request will be created at here. And then let's try to create a payslip for this employee for this month. For that, let's go to payroll again. And then the payroll, I am, cre I am creating it for 
so the automatically the structure the launch structure will be populated at here here and then compute the sheet so inside the sheet we can see that uh, the total either total salary is 5000 and then the loan amount of 2000 will be detected from the detected from his salary and then his net salary is 3000 likewise we can create loan requests that means employees can lo create loan requests and automatically that loan amount the installment amount will be detected from their salary by the management likewise we can manage the loan management inside your company this module helps to configure different loan policies and uh, the higher authorities can assign it and then also give it sanction and then the further verification can be done as properly.